Don't be discouraged. It's happened all the time. You think you got it, then you think you lose it, and then you still got it. No, you've 16, lost it. <laughs> then understood they how that he bade them not beware of the leaven of bread, but of the doctrine of the Pharisees and the Sadducees. Okay, so we know what's going on there. And this is what I was uh, bringing up out about on his way to Caesarea. And uh, I said it was a, a bad place, a evil place. And uh, you complained about that, didn't you? But Jesus goes to the uh, lost sheep and he was on his way to Caesarea. And at, the, at that point where he said, who, do, who does man say I am? And Peter answered him with the correct answer. But they were at the foot of Mount Hermon. 33 degree longitude, 33 degree latitude, where at the bottom of Mount Hermon is a pan worship cave. This pan worship cave is where Jesus stood in front of when he asked Peter, who does man think I am? Okay, now, and I also said in that video that uh, they said, oh, they're John the Baptist. Well, Jesus knew John the Baptist. So how could he be an, a reincarnated John Baptist? And this is, where you explained, oh, it's a reincarnation and this and that. And, uh, you know, there's no such thing as reincarnation. And you manipulate the meaning of what reincarnation is. Okay? Because a man is uh, to live one life, to die, and then be judged. Okay? You cannot change the scripture. Whom do men say that I, the son of man, am? Why you cannot see it? Now, what I was talking about, and we're going to see if we can get it up here on the computer here. The scribes and Pharisees challenge Jesus. And said he was saying blasphemy because he was the son of God. Let's see what we get here. No, we got Matthew 10, which, yeah, I remember that. Um, it was just when the scribes and Pharisees, um, I didn't pinpoint it enough here, but it's just when the scribes and Pharisees uh, thought uh, our plan to kill Jesus um, just before he went up into the uh, mountain with I think Peter and uh, a couple of the others and they f were falling asleep and then Judas came it was just before then but uh, the scribes and Pharisees were questioning Jesus with uh trying to catch him in his answers. My Gaver, why you cannot say son of man and you say son of God instead because you're not quoting right. And you the son of man with a capital S is Jesus, born of a virgin mother. Open the womb of a virgin woman was a virgin marriage okay so she was a virgin when she was married the father entered mary excuse me there was no physical it was a spiritual thing it's through an immaculate conception okay satan has to mate physically and that's the difference. And Satan's trying to imitate what the father did with Mary. And he produces Nephilims. Okay, now Satan, again, is the fallen Lucifer, which uh, Team Joe totally confuses because he does not read his scriptures from front to back. He just uh, gets on his, uh, his crack rave and uh, his imagination goes wild like, uh, <laughs> like a lawyer, okay? And, and a lawyer 
Would a lawyer uh, let go of a golden life jacket if he knew he was treading in deep water? Okay. You're running around like a chicken with his head cut off. Just like your logo explains. You're running around. Uh, and that's another thing. I said, uh, the father is a consuming fire. And you change that. You're running from the consuming fire, the true word, like a chicken with his head cut off, using Illuminati colors, okay? If that's not as plain as day, <laughs> Father, again, I can only respond to what is worthwhile. You told me what his attempts are. And I am two steps ahead of him. And all they have to do is review my first 20 videos. Now I can be like Jonathan Clack and repeat everything over and over and over again. But no, that's what Team Joe is doing. With these long explanations of how he feels things are and it's not actually scriptures and he tries to bury it in parallels which he does not make the parallel you make them it's your word not team joe's word not my word it's the word of scriptures which is the foundation of salvation thank you father thank you jesus and in jesus name i pray amen